So today over at Harbor Freight, I picked up a Portland electric pole saw. I've been needing to get one of these for a while to trim some trees in my front yard. And normally I do it with a ladder and a Husqvarna right here, but I thought I'd buy one of these and give an honest review on it, see if it's worth anything or if it's junk. But um, I was over there today, I ended up paying $79.99 plus tax. The prices went up a little bit from what it used to be, but we're going to see if it's worth the money and put it together and see what y'all think. So in the box, you have your pole saw. <coughs> Comes with an Oregon chain, instruction manual, um, an Allen key so you can uh, tighten the tensioner. <coughs> you got your blade and cover. And from what I'm assuming here, loosen this cover up. <coughs> Just like any chainsaw, it's going to set in right here. Or get a flathead screwdriver, you'll have to adjust back the tensioner here. So it'll sit in line just like this, like any other chainsaw. You put your chain on, put your cover back on, tighten it down. And um, I guess the top right here, you fill it up with some bar oil. I'm assuming about any bar oil will work. I guess if you have to read your instruction manual and see what it says. But I'm going to put what I got in it and hope for the best. But yeah, we'll get this thing together and uh, we'll give you an honest review of what I think about it. Just like anything else, electric. You're going to have to deal with an extension cord. But for $79, we'll see if uh, it's worth anything. Adjust this out to the longest point. So, honestly, it's not that bad for the price. Um, longevity, we'll have to see as time goes. Maybe make another video on how it is after several uses. But so far, I'm pretty impressed with it. 